some of the main differences, and this is a theme that I'll try to explain consistently, you know, as I try to develop the framework for Europe for everyone to understand. In the U.S., we have a dispensary networks in a state-by-state expansion. Canada, they started off by sending cannabis through the, the Royal Mail. Now they've started to develop in Canada 2.0 edibles and, and dispensaries. And already you're seeing large multinationals in Canada uh, wanting to distribute the product. In Europe and most of the other world, besides Canada and the United States, the distribution networks are the pharmacy networks. So imagine that. Hundreds of thousands of pharmacies become your distribution network. No need to develop uh, standalone dispensaries. The reach is far enough to get to all of the population because the pharmacy networks have been developed for decades, whether you need your aspirins or your toothpaste or, you know, whatever uh, pills, antibiotics. So, you know, that outreach is pretty massive and it's almost unfathomable when you really think about it. The EU just even in the last two years has gone from a handful of legal countries to 26 countries out of 27 that uh, in the EU itself that have some sort of medical program. Just in the EU alone, and I'm just talking in the EU countries, there's over 100,000 pharmacies. There's half of that in the United States. Imagine like if you were a grower or a producer, uh, you were making your products and you had to supply one bag of flour uh, or one product, just one, to each of those pharmacies, each of those 100,000 pharmacies, like one time a month or one time a week or one time, you know, daily, just the sheer volume in order to be able to have a national distribution all over the continent is a massive undertaking. And they're at their beginning stages. I mean, you definitely have key markets like Germany and the UK, uh, France, Poland, Italy, and Switzerland. You have non-EU markets like Brazil and Israel. Israel is taking on uh, a recreational program this year. But what you have is, is a large expansion. And the main mode of getting the product to the patients is by through the pharmacy network.